Sarul Shafiq. Good morning, I'm Lucia. And this is Oopsie TV. On April 8, 1997, a woman was arrested for the case of embezzlement. The case happened in Shanghai, China. The accused, Zhao Xing, a 50-year-old woman, was arrested by police for theft over 240,000 yuan over the period of six months. According to the report, Zhao Xing was the two working in a company called Wan Ke Company downstairs. It is a residential company. The company provides rental housing, primary co property development, operation, and logistics warehousing. Zhao Xing was arrested at her own residence. The courts decided that Zhao Xing should be sentenced to seven years of imprisonment in Shanghai Women's Prison in China. According to the news report, Zhao Xing was an excellent student who graduated from her school. She entered the white collar industry when she was 25 years old. Zhao Xing was first offered to work as a stay in school staff, but quickly rejected it because she thought it does not fit with her achievements. After a few years of working, Zhao Xing finally took a big step and applied for one of the well known white collar companies, which was one co company downstairs. Inside the company, she was working in the human resources department, where she was in charge of salaries, distribution. That was when she finally gave in to committing crimes. According to the report, Zhao Xing drew 240,000 yuan in total from the company into her account. It was reported that it was due to negligence of two workers who were supposed to be supervising her work. The money was taken out monthly for half a year. What color me? What color workers are suit and tie workers who work in offices and does not require physical labor? What color jobs typically are higher paid, higher skilled jobs that require more education and training than low skilled, more manual work? What is white collar crime? White collar crime is a non violent crime often characterized by deceit or concealment to obtain or avoid losing money or property or to gain a business advantage. Examples of white collar crimes include securities fraud, embezzlement, corporate fraud, and money laundering. For embezzlement, it is a type of financial fraud where someone takes money or assets that were entrusted to them and uses them for a different purpose other than for what they were intended. In this case, the money was meant to be part of the worker's salaries, but it was used by Zhao Xing for her own benefit. Main factor of what color crime. In this case, system management was not in place. When there are no proper supervisions around, the tendency for misconduct inside the working place is high. Some of the effects that come with white collar crimes are massive financial loss, it also erodes trust in institutions, distort market competition, it will also contribute to social inequality and overall just destabilize the economy. Strategies to deal with white collar crime. The first law enforcement encouraging employees to challenge the status and uh, speak up against uh, unequal practice can create an environment that values transparency and uh, integrity. Uh, industry wide education programs for making integrity summits across industries is uh, crucial to raise awareness. Our final advice to the audience is that we should enhance our legal awareness and moral sense, abide the law. And overall, just be an honest person. That's all for today's news. I'm Sharu Shafi. I'm Lucia. OCTV reporting out.